I wonder if he's trying to catch uh, Storm jumping. jumping. Uh, that is Most orc. swords I, I'm used to seeing usually run like a buff support, because sword has really solid anti-air tools with like 8Y and... The, the moment he gets buffed. And 4Y. 4Y like four y gang spam for that forever. <laughs> but... And we're getting into it right here. Just straight out of the gate straight forward out of the Y. Gate, forward Y. Getting into this match. Koei right. showing a lot of pressure. With Shadow Mewtwo, Thunderbolt, getting in him in the corner. <laughs> oh, getting, oh, didn't quite finish the combo. Oh, that was a bad fight. X right there, not being buffed. He, he needs to Definitely get buffed in needs order that to buff. do some damage. Oh, nice, nice flash, flash cannon, cannon there. He's getting more of his buffs here. Keeping Shadow Mewtwo away. That chip. Oh, Corp deciding to pop first here. Oh, oh that's that gonna be a first punish for the connection. And no full edgy animation, Corp gonna but take that's okay. <laughs> Corp gonna take round one of game one. I think uh, what Koei needs to be using more here is more of his like counter, like wow. armor for properties. Oh yeah, so much. Very nice thunderbolt and shield break. Getting the shield break. Uh, nice six X coming out here. Is he gonna get a buff from this? No, he's not. He's gonna get a buff here, but no conversion. Four Y counter piercing. Nice, setting himself up. Nice forward Y coming out. Forward Y is a really good option right here because he's gonna go through a lot of shadow mages projectiles. Gonna get the field shift. Uh, buff is going to definitely oh, that's a first conversion. That's going to do a lot of damage there. And it's probably going to leave Koei at like around 25, maybe 50 HP. Look, can it look like he does a few wall splats in that? Yep. Oh, no? uh, it was close. 62. Corp going to heal nothing here <laughs> and get hit by the Rotom. And Pai trying to pop first so that he can. Nice teleport coming from Corp. Corp rushing in, getting hit by a 6 or a 4x. Four four y, four y. That's 4x. Yeah, it's back x. But 4y is the anti air. Which H slash can just use over and over again when he's buffed because he's like minus 4 afterwards. But that was weird. It was a very weird thing, Ed, but. Weird option there. I, I get if he were a little closer, that might have hit him. Pressure in with the. I don't know what that means. <laughs> oh, that is punishable right uh, there. It looks like he didn't take the opportunity for it. Probably doesn't know the opportunity. Very that nice was jump over. I interesting. He got that. That's gonna get him a. Not a combo. Bursting out of pressure. Just trying to catch him jumping. I like how Corp's using his, like. 5A to kind of pressure oh, and then get no, in. Fell down the wall. That could have been a punish. Nice grab coming out from Corp. Oh wow. my gosh. Just the stare down up to it. Yeah. I think what Koei needs to kind of do here is kind of play Aegislash a little bit like defensively in a way, but still when he has his buffs, go for those when options when he can get that damage with his buffs and like add more pressure onto the situation when he does not buff. Most of the time Shadow Mewtwo's been in, he hasn't had a buff or like comboed into a buff. Or like, so he's sharp and safe. And more moves I think he should use, like 4Y, etc. Right here, he should iron, should iron head. That works. And he's getting in Shadow Mewtwo's face with no buffs. Yeah, he... Which is dangerous. He also needs to start setting up a lot more. Yeah. Because that is a very good, makes a lot of options safer. That, is, like, neutral has been very interesting between these two. I feel like Koei's just throwing out a lot of things, and now Corp is reacting with, like, 5A to kind of counteract that. Is Corp gonna, yep. Very nice, Get the uh, forward Y. He's gonna have his burst, setting up Krogunk. Not even using Krogunk. Grabbing the Rotom. <laughs> oh, recovering in his face. He has some burst, he's dead. 
I don't really agree with the burst there, but it did kind of intimidate Toy a little bit. And now I can hear myself. Oh! Nice thunder. Still getting punished for it. Oh, he dashed back into it on accident, it looks like. That was a nice reaction to grab right there. Or counter, not grab. <laughs> nice reaction. It was a nice grab reaction. Yes. That's the word I was looking for. Corp's just going in right now, does not even care. Oh no. That Rotom's gonna help a lot. Just three six X's in a row. Getting his buff real quick. Nice. Sylveon to help uh, mitigate some of the damage from that buff. Gonna use the burst for chip. Not it's a lot. From that distance, but exhaust may have betrayed him. <laughs> oh! He could use King Shield to kind of mitigate that 5A Shadow Ball. It's Very nice safe. jump over the uh, Shadow King. Nice use of 5x there. Oh, that shield's looking very low right now. Nice, another 5x to take the game, take the round. Do you want to switch? Okay. We'll drop the shield on the very last Getting the, of the homing. Space shift is gonna help Shadow Mew two a lot. Just frame one. Just, Just frame, frame two. two. Need some five wise in there. Oh, very counter. nice counter. Storm's still going in and taking his defensive playstyle against him. Tried to Storm. jump out of homing. I think Corp's gonna burst here. Yep. Add more pressure onto the situation. Uh, oh, bad jump option. Interesting jump Y there. Nice, that's gonna punish Spike Kill. Oh, no, not chip. quite. And Sword didn't have all the PSP there. I think Corp would have died. He's just got to get in. Oh, is that not, not quite, it? Not quite. Is is he, he's going to pop. Yep. This is very close. Koei has first. Going to use it off the bat. He's got one HP, but Shadow Mute oh, is being there. Oh, that's it. Oh. Corp takes the bat. <laughs> okay. 